Welcome back everyone and today's video is on Maniology's May 2024 MXM box and I've already sliced the tape so we can go ahead and get into what's inside. So this month's theme is our furry friends, cats and dogs, and we get two cards, one describing the polishes and the other products inside, and one with a mini and spo card and how they did it, which are super cute. Let's see what else we've got inside here today. Ooh, that is a pretty good size. Okay, so this month we get a paw print shaped ooh, silicone palette. Nice, and it's a nice good quality. <laughs> it's very floppy too. Um, I actually have been wanting a silicone palette. I've been using a geode I got when I was, I believe, 11 years old. So this is real geode. I got this in Arizona years ago, and I just never had a good use for it, so I've been using it as a palette for years. Um, but this is nice and soft, which means it'd be easy to clean up. Once the polish dries, I can just peel it right off. That's really nice. I do like that. Okay. Oh, I got the Snail It sticker. That's too cute. Do I even have the Snail It sticker? I think I do. I've got lots of extra stickers. So they started adding these in uh, a little while ago, and I'm glad that they did. These are instructions for the care of your products, um, as well as how to stamp. And it has little tips and tricks and instructions uh, and things like that. Uh, and they even have a QR code to allow you to pull up specific videos on stamping, which is nice. And our polishes. So I still need to look into what polishes I have that look like these to do our comparisons. But we have Tippy Taps, which is almost like a milky coffee color looking at it like coffee that you add just a little bit of milk to it's nice all right so the next one is chonk which <laughs> i've got a chonk of my own she's around here somewhere my leia girl she's such a freaking chonky cat and this is a good ginger kitty color. Topaz, you want to come here? You're licking that paw. Topaz, come here. Come here, boy. Let's do a comparison. Though you got some grays in you. Come on. Let's do a comparison. Let's do a comparison. Hmm? Does that look like your color? Yeah. <laughs> Does that look like your color, my old boy? <laughs> I think that's your color, right? Does that match your fur? Yeah. <laughs> I, I think that's a good match. It's just a little bit brighter than him now because he's old and he's got some grays, but I think that's a good color comparison. <laughs> it's my old ginger boy. So, a little fun fact that I didn't know. I used to actually have a rather rare cat that I'd gotten from the animal shelter. Apparently, uh, orange tabbies are primarily male, just like calicos are primarily female. And I had a female orange tabby, and I did not know that she was rare at that time. So it was kind of surprising. I found out later on that that was, she was a rare, rare breed. But I have my orange ginger boy right here in Peach, who is orange and white which is his brother in a litter mate. Okay, so let's look at this first plate. And this is MXM 127. And if I can get this film off, 
Maybe if I can get this film up. Ooh, what is on? I just did dishes recently and I'm wondering if that's why. Because something stuck to me like that. That's gross. I thought I cleaned everything off. Or maybe that's just adhesive from the tape. Probably adhesive from the tape because I could have swore I got everything off. All right. Tweezer time. I'm done fighting with it. I'm done fighting with it. That one was on there good. I couldn't get it to lift up at all. While we're at it, just in case. So I don't have to fight with that one too. Haha. -ha. That one was a lot easier. Alright. Got that. Okay. So this is super cute. Absolutely adorable. And I'm going to have fun doing a mani with these. And I haven't decided if I want to do one hand dogs, one hand cats, and or if I want to do one that's all dogs and one that's all cats and have matching hands. I don't know. These are absolutely adorable. Look at that, guys. I know my husband's going to insist upon the corgi. My husband loves corgis and I love huskies. I love huskies. He loves corgis. Um, dogs are just too high maintenance for our household. It's the biggest problem, but we're animal lovers here. We love all animals. We just need lower maintenance, uh, <laughs> lower maintenance pets. And then this adorable cat plate. Oh my goodness. I love the little kitty snoot. That is absolutely adorable. The kitty snoot is so adorable. Oh my goodness. And I love these little peekaboo cats. They're so cute. I'm, I wish there were some peekaboo dogs on here, but there's not. There's just dogs up on a ledge, which is cute too. I like that as well. But the peekaboo cats, I wish they had the dogs on there as well like that because that's super cute. But alas, they don't. And if any of you who have watched my... Uh, stamping plate collection video knows that I have lots of cats and dog plates because I love animals and I have lots of different animal plates uh, <laughs> because once again I love animals and so does the rest of my family so yeah this is a really good one and this guys this is a really good quality silicon it actually it 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 feels almost like a stamper. Uh, this is not the first time I've recently that I've handled silicon that was this nice, but um, that's for next week's video. <laughs> but yeah, no, this is, this is very nice. I am definitely looking forward to being able to use this, especially since it being what it is. It's, once it's there, it's going to be hard to move. It's, it's on there good. Like, it's rolling, not. So, and because this is silicon and not something sharp like the edges of this is, I can actually have it off of my mat on my desk, which is nice because I'm so afraid of scratching at my desk. There's already some damage from my, um, camera stand and um, some other stuff that um, like my lighting that I used to have and I hate that there's damage to, to the desk already from that stuff it really irritates me because it's not very old uh, I think I've had this for I think we're going on our second year now um, I, I've had it for at least a year, but I don't think I've had it for quite two years. I think we are literally working on our second year now. And unfortunately, you know, in that short period of time, my filming equipment and my lighting equipment and things like that before I upgraded it had caused some, some damage. So I'm trying to keep my desk nice. And I love this because I can have a nice palette with little individual slots and a mixing area, so to speak, because this would be great for mixing. Um, that's not going to damage my desk 
and that's awesome. And I've had this out of the packaging for all of a few minutes and it's already covered in cat hair. <laughs> uh, it is already covered in cat hair. Okay, so for my lovely pet owners on my channel, if you are able to keep your pet litter out of your stuff, please tell me how because I would love to know. <laughs> My lovely fur babies that I love so much share so much hair in my products that it's absolutely insane. So yeah, no, I'm I'm excited. We're going to have some color comparison swatch videos going on here before long, but these are adorable guys. Oh my goodness. Uh, I get the feeling my husband's also gonna want a pedicure with the corgi. I can already see that. I love this one. And there's a husky, like, front and center, guys. Right there. Look at that beauty. Look at that beauty. Oh, my goodness. Oh, I didn't even notice that before. That bird, there's a bird there. Okay, so each one of these paws have something above it, uh, like what they're trying to get. And that one has a little bird. Oh, that's adorable. I love this image, too. I'm used to seeing my cats looking like that because we have birds around our house everywhere and they're always looking up out the windows of the doors and the, the windows at the front of the house at the at the birds outside because we have bird feeders around the house. So yes, that's, that's everything in the box, guys. Uh, that's a very nice, um, almost like a milky brown, I guess is the way to put it, and a very nice um, gingery, creamy orange. There's a slight brown hue to it. It's got a very, it's a very warm, warm orange. And this awesome silicon palette. I've actually thought about getting Manny Scripps, formerly Manitude, um, silicon palette, and this saves me from having to actually purchase um, one assuming they still that they have brought it back up available uh, but yeah no this is this is super cute guys there's lots of different oh is that a Maine Coon that's a Maine Coon oh my goodness <laughs> sorry sidetracked squirrel <laughs> that's all that's in there guys it's super cute um, another thing that I wish they had, I guess, that was like their version of having the silhouette cats was they have this toy image here for the dogs, but they don't for the cats, but they don't have the little like peeking around the corner dogs like they do with the cats. So I guess that's their way of evening, evening out. But I wish there was one that was like all a, ver a variety of cat toys like they do with the dog toys. That would have been really cool. They got cat paws instead. So I guess that's one way to put it. Okay, so that's all of it, guys. So I hope this was helpful in your decision making on this box. And they're super cute. And we will have a design later this month for, well, I say this month, even though it's the end of April, um, the towards the end of May, because I've already uploaded several Mannies um, for May already, including a Mother's Day Manny and this lovely one I'm wearing right now. So keep your eyes peeled for this one. It's coming up soon. Uh, Mid-May is when this one will be there. And the... I've had other people, there's a nice lovely snake based, snake themed Manny that I have coming up this Thursday, I believe. I believe it's this Thursday. So stay tuned for that one as well. <laughs> so I don't have any announcements. Um, that's all guys. 
So I hope you all are having a good morning, afternoon, evening, or night, wherever you are at, wherever you, while you were watching this video. And until next time, guys, thank you all for watching. Bye.